Gatorland is a fun family adventure for all ages. We went to Gatorland today and had a great time. Definitely coming back again because we did not see enough. There were gators everywhere. All this water, all these ponds. They had these little fishing pole things and people were, it was like man against gator. They were trying to like drop this little fish thing down there and they get the gator would start to jump up and get it and they'd lift it up really fast. So it was kind of fun. It was like, to, let's see who can make it, the gator or the person. Needless to say, a lot of gators got fed and a lot of people had an empty line. Uh, they had white alligator or white alligators. They had some that if you looked in their eye, the blue eye of it, it was supposed to bring you good luck. So of course we did that. There's alligators, crocodiles. They even have turtles, snakes, and what's this on here? They have mountain lions as well. We got to see the little baby ones that were just maybe a year old. And those are like less than a feet, but they were still so big and kind of cute. When we walked further down, you can see these bigger gators at least six to eight feet from snout to tail. We decided to go exploring to see how big Gatorland was. And believe me, it didn't look big at first, but that's just an illusion. We maybe have spent four, maybe five hours there just walking. We went to this side of Gatorland where we actually got to see pythons, tortoises. They even had wild mountain lions there. Oh my gosh, we had the best time. I've been trying for years to get my family to go to Gatorland. And finally this time they all decided they wanted to go. Weather was perfect, it was awesome. The only thing is they somehow convinced me to do zip line, which I had no intentions whatsoever to do because I wasn't afraid of the gators. I was just more afraid of falling or being stuck in the middle. The thing that's gonna stick with me, we're getting ready to walk out and there is this pond area and it's got a half, I don't know, 40, 60 alligators in it. All there is looking at you are noses and eyes. It's like they're just waiting for you to trip and fall in. It is the weirdest looking thing. So next time you're in Florida, consider coming to Gatorland.